Yo, what is up? It's Aragonic. I'm here with a level 50 update. So the thing is, like, I wanted to do more regular updates, but I'm not gaining the progress that I wish I was. So there's not as much stuff to share. That should be changing, though, because now I'm kind of getting an idea and a grasp of what I, I should be and what I should be doing in general. I feel like I kind of got stuck in this kind of... um ditch or hit a wall in a sense where I wasn't really uh progressing but I wasn't going back like I was kind of just staying in this lull you know um so one thing is that I was not focusing originally on uh what dungeons I really should be doing I kind of got stuck in the whole do the endless trial do the dispatches do uh, the arenas do um, the guild stuff, do um, all the glyphs for all the characters, and I've just been expanding my roster. However, my roster is expanding pretty slowly. Okay, disconnect from server. Well, ignore that. Um, my, my roster has been changing slowly. I've also not invested in the best of gear, I feel like. So, I think... I'm going to probably take some more advice in general, look a little bit more into what I should be doing, simply because I'm hitting walls that I'm not quite sure, you know, like, so I was going for pushing the fire dungeon for um, gear. I have changed my idea now, though, to go for more of revival set. So Zatlux, for example, We've got him up to 83% crit rate, but he's got the 30% passive, so that's even more than I need. But his gear, for example, this is enough to actually hold him. I want to get better revival pieces for him, so I'm keeping these at 12 and whatnot. But we've got the attack boots, we're working on crit damage. Um, we need more crit damage, that's where we're really like failing. However, the revival set is kind of carrying me um i don't have a specific character for healing i also since i'm so heavy on water element i'm kind of struggling when it comes to other dungeons like branching out from just fire you know so my uh damage to queen of tides is kind of lackluster it takes a while and that's not like 10 i think where where are we i mean i haven't tried the next one yet because of how long it's taking oh uh, yeah we're only doing nine so we're going for basically just five stars we're getting we're scrapping all the four uh i want to get to 11 uh, 11 is the goal however because of our investment in characters we've just we're just so behind um santis is another one she's 58 out of 60 but ignore that she's just just pretend she's 60. So, originally I was investing in, like, a, well, I guess these four, are, or these four, and now we've branched out to Hakran as well. We've got him fully glyphed out. We've got Zatlux, Zrina, Nathalia, Sierra, Ciara. So, this, this one I'm not sure if it was a... Let me turn this down just a tad. Is Ciara, I'm not quite sure if that was a mistake or not. Um, because right after I invested in her for an event, I believe, I got hit with not using her for Queen of Tides. Like, I've just, I realized how strong the revival set is now. And that's definitely, I feel really dumb because I'm super behind now. At level 50, I should be way further, way further ahead. But, you know, I mean, I'm learning and I'm taking my time. I'm enjoying the game for what it is. Like, I just, in, you know, I enjoy collectibles and whatnot. But speaking of collectibles, which, well, actually, okay, I'm all over the place. Um, Connor as well. We we did finish out his glyphs. Uh, I think that's it for glyphs and stuff like that. For characters, I don't think that there's anything like too super new either. Yeah, no, not really. We're working on getting some of the other characters for um, fusion. What is it? Um, let's see here. 
the uh, synthesis. We're going to start working on um, uh, Duke Hackrens so that we can buff up our Hackron. Santis as well. That's important. I'm going to ignore these for now. I don't like they're probably great, but I just it's not it's going to take a while, man. It's going to take a while. I kind of want to buff up these two that I already have, you know? Um, Rena, don't even that there's like no update on that one. As for events, because of the revival stuff I wanted to try out, we did completely barrel through the gear enhancement event, uh, just getting those sets going so that I can start farming. Um, it sucks because of how, you know, again, how behind we are. And I'm not even sure if that's really the best set to go for revival, but right now that's kind of what I'm seeming to need. Uh, one thing is though, um, and I've closed out of it each time. What is the, is there a news in here? There probably is, and I'm just completely blind. However, um, yeah, that's not going to be it. Um, <clears throat> We still have not done a summon session. We are up to 135. And that's a good amount. That's a good handful or so, yeah? Um, and we've got 10.6k uh, diamonds. So what I'm wondering is, honestly, is it about time to summon? Because I am all water. And we are going to be building up uh, a roster. Like, we, we, we have, we have, like, the baseline of stuff, right? But we don't have the baseline of stuff. You know, exact, exactly what I just said. The, we got the baseline of stuff, but not the baseline of the baseline of stuff. Where, basically, if we're going water, we're okay. But anything else, we're kind of a subpar. We are not optimal, all right? We are the opposite of optimal. We are sub-optimal, you could say. But, yeah, no, I'm, I'm kind of stuck i'm kind of a little bit on uh i'm not sure what i should be doing at this point so what i'm going to do since i'm not fully sure i know that revival is not going to be worthless i know that this is strong no matter what so i'm going to at least be farming all of my energy into revival i'm just gonna get the best I, sets i can i'm gonna hopefully upgrade my zatlux with better gear and i'm going to think about summoning I, I think it's time to start going through my um, summoning, what is this, summoning shards or summoning, how, what do they call it? Yeah, summon crystals, okay. Like, who knows? You know, maybe we'll get something really good, maybe we won't, but we'll do one summon for the, you know, random YOLO. However, um, I, I think it is about time to summon. Just, we need something other than water. Uh, otherwise, I'm still, like I said, I'm still really enjoying the game. Um, we... Uh, oh, an adventure, yeah. Adventure, we have gotten up to... 8. Um, because of glyphs. I think I will be tonight pushing through 10. I think we can get through 10. We can at least get through 9, I believe. There's no way we can't, right? No shot. No shot we don't get through it. But, uh, yeah. So we're going to do the adventure. And then shortly after, we're just going to do revival. And we're going to see where we go. Where, how I feel. Like, if we push revival sets on our character, our team. And then we're not able to push Queen of Tides too much further. Because I want to get to 11. Um, I guess we, we summon, I guess we summon for a, uh, grass wood element and just go from there. You know, it's, it's definitely tough. Like, yeah, hopefully, hopefully it's, you know, it is what it is. You know, sometimes you, uh, get them, sometimes you get got, but, um, yeah, well, that's my level 50 update. I'm actually going to be updating again, though, in probably a day or two, even. Because there's 
quite a lot that I'm planning to do in these next couple days, but I wanted to get a video out when I hit 50 at least, and I was almost 51 just from auto farming, didn't notice. So here's the 50 update. We're not crazy. We're not doing do hop, but we're not doing awful either. We've got solid characters that we definitely can build teams with. We just need some of that well rounding around it, you know, and, uh, you know, enjoy Hydrosia's boobot. Thank you for, uh, you know, checking out the video. I hope you have a wonderful day. You're an absolute cutie for stopping by and, uh, yeah, take, uh, take good care of yourself. See you next time.